Hey filmmakers, Shongli here. In this video, I'm releasing the smooth zoom transition for Final Cut Pro. So first things first, go to the link in the description below. You will land on this page. And this is the most important section. If you already subscribed or like my page or uh, follow me on Twitter, please share out or tweet out this page so that other people also get to know what I'm doing. And if you really appreciate what I do, there's also a donate button here below. Once you have downloaded the file, unzip it, go to this section here, copy this part, and then go to Finder, and go to go to folder here, and paste it in here. And this part where it says your username, change it to your name. Mine is my name, Shongda. And then you will get to this folder called FX Presets and just copy all the presets into this folder and then restart your Final Cut Pro. Once you have restarted Final Cut Pro, go to your FX and here on the video we have Shongda Smooth Transitions and you will have these four presets. So the zoom in, in and the zoom in out uh, are together so the zoom in is of course the direction where it zooms and at the end the in and out is where to place these presets so the in is for the beginning of like a clip and the out for at the end of a clip so these are not like your normal transitions where you can just drag and drop them you do need to cut out your clip a few parts so first go between your two clips then hold down shift and arrow once to one side and then command B to cut it then the also on the other side and now we we'll just drag in the zoom in in on this part and the zoom in out on the other part and now we have the zoom transition and now showing you the other one the zoom out so the out here and the in here And you can also get a cross zoom by putting the zoom in out here and the zoom out in here. And that was the smooth zoom transition for Final Cut Pro. If you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. If you want to see more upcoming videos, please subscribe. There's also a lot of other tutorials and tips and tricks on this channel, so check them out. If you have any questions, please comment below and I'll see you the next time. Bye bye.